Anytime I think about the struggles this company has gone through, I think back to the days when we first started. Uh, the stories I've heard, and of course I wasn't here during those times, but uh, Ed Bean, founder of this company in 1949, and how he borrowed his parents' car. Not sure if his folks knew about that, but uh, when he borrowed his folks' car, uh, when they went away to Europe uh, for vacation, and he decided he was going to open up a glass company. And uh, basically took the back seat out of the vehicle, put a piece of plywood in so they could carry glass around the city of Edmonton, and uh, just to do work on his neighbors and get things started. We're talking struggles of 63 years here for this guy, and that's where it all started. From those humble beginnings when he started off uh, in the back of his father's vehicle, uh, Ed uh, saved his pennies while he was doing work for his neighbors and uh, spent the, uh, the money he had to acquire a building, a rental property on White Avenue, opening his first store in 1949. Uh, boy, I, the stories that I hear about uh, those days uh, when it was him and, and one or two other people just trying to make ends meet, uh, it's incredible that he's, uh, he's come to the place where he is now. When we opened up Can-Am Glass Products, uh, which is a division of our crystal glass uh, business model, Canon Glass Products is that manufacturing facility that we developed uh, about 11, 12 years ago. Our vision for that was a one-stop shop for industrial manufacturing of the glass products that are going to be used here in Alberta. Uh, when we began to plan that, uh, we saw that automation was going to be really important, uh, but knowing our organization, it couldn't be the only thing. Uh, it's very important that we were going to employ as many people as we could and put them to work here in Edmonton, uh, but, it, but to be able to integrate that with uh, the latest and greatest in technology. So when we began to build it, we started looking at lean manufacturing. We began traveling around the world looking for equipment. It's a very unique plant in that uh, our cutting line was from Italy. Our sealed unit manufacturing uh, line, which is a, a window manufacturing system, came from Austria. Uh, our tempering furnace was developed in Finland, uh, built in the U.S., but developed in Finland. Um, we have beveling equipment and edging equipment and, uh, and cutting systems. Truly, it's one of the most uh, technologically advanced plants in Western Canada. But the vision was uh, to be able to manufacture as much as we possibly could using technology, but integrating it with good people. And that's what we were able to accomplish. Crystal Glass, for all your glass needs.